Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV here at SIG Range Day, SHOT Show 2023 with my buddy John. John is with the Electro Optics Division. Yep. That's what we're calling yes. it, the Electro Optics Division. It sounds yes. a lot more sophisticated oh, yeah. than just Fancy. plain old optics. Gotta have some Electro in there. And we've got some Electro Optics mm -hmm. right here today. A new one. Um, I don't even want to say any more. How about, you know, you tell, I mean, you're the expert. Sure, yeah, so. no, this, this is our new Romeo M17. So this was designed from the ground up to fit on the MHS contract pistol for the U.S. military. Um, some very unique features about it. We've got multiple design patents on this. Uh, it mounts from underneath, which is kind of a first. Oh, right. Yes, yeah, so you remove the optics plate in the rear sight from the M17, and you're left with a hole in the rear of the slide. This actually toes in from the front, cams down with two recoil lugs underneath and then mounts with that hole in the back of the slide with your with your existing M17 rear sight block. So you maintain your standard height sights, you get a full co-witness, you don't need suppressor height sights, and it's a super solid lockup going to 40 inch pounds on that mounting screw. So it- I was gonna ask about nowhere. the inch pounds. Yeah. yeah. Uh, why do I want an enclosed optic? I mean, we know the answer to that, but for people out there saying, okay, yeah. so what? Your emitter is completely protected at all times. Water, dust, dirt, dropping it anywhere. Um, you're never gonna get that reticle interrupted by anything. Mm -hmm. So completely sealed, it's gas purged. Uh, good for IPX7 and beyond that, so. Um, and essentially like water resistance, very dust water resistance. resistance. Yes. And gas purging means like you're not gonna get, because you know, I've run into that. Whenever you go from varying temperatures, yeah, no fogging you'll, get, issues. you'll get fogging yep. inside, but if it's gas purged, Yeah, think of it won't. like a Think of it like a, a micro red dot on a rifle, but it's shrunk down for a pistol. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, this looks, I mean, frankly, tough as shit. It is. What it kind is. of testing did you guys do on this? Uh, drop testing, five feet onto concrete, um, 10,000 round minimum on nine millimeter plus P. Uh, it is absolutely rugged. And this, this design language that we're going with on this optic in particular will influence most of the pistol reflex sights you see coming out of our division in the next year. So there's a lot more to come where this, where this came from. John, so. would you say that this is your toughest pistol optic? I don't know, it might be a stretch. I would but. say it is by far the best pistol optic ever made by humans. Okay. Yes. All right. I thought I went kind of far, but I no, mean, I'm I glad you went there. Go far. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No. And I and I appreciate that. And that's why I'm glad you're on the program, John. Yeah, yeah. What are we looking at for battery life? Uh, minimum twenty thousand hours when you're running at medium settings, and that's without even Motac kicking in. So once you get all those battery saving features, it's going to be years. Yeah. What's it, like two and a half years or yeah, something? Crazy. Yeah. After. Okay. Running a full twenty thirty two battery mounted on the side. Oh, right so, here. Yeah, yep. So. One of the things that does is it allows us to bury that optic as low as possible in right. the slide. So you yeah, get a I full, that. And you get a full, full sight co picture yeah. with and standard co -witness. sights. Yep. Yeah, with Absolutely. standard height sights. Well, how much is this going to set me back? I, I bet it's not going to be so cheap. Pricing isn't totally set at this point. We're obviously hoping I mean, this to, is new, to new. sell to um, you know Department of Defense right. customers. Um, eventually, we'll have a commercial version that'll be compatible with more pistols than just the MHS mm -hmm. contract pistol. Um, you're probably looking retail in the 600 to 700 range, right in there where the Romeo 2 is and some mm -hmm. of the other competitors. Okay, I mean, yeah, for what you're getting, like, I mean, Fully that's what US you would, assemble. Yeah, yeah, it's, you're, you're paying what you would expect yeah. to pay for that. Any other features like reticle options, you know, that So it comes with about? a circle dot reticle. So you get a two MOA dot, 32 MOA circle, and it's independently selectable. So you can just hold down the rear button on the left side over there and cycle through those reticles so you get what you want. 15 brightness settings, three of which are night vision. Mm -hmm. um, our coatings are specially tuned for uh, NV, so uh, we've done a ton of testing with special forces and uh, tier one guys, and this is by far the best optic they've used as well. So, so this is the first iteration of what is to come. From yes, the this is the, the future. Electro optics. It's the future of our Division. optics, yes. John, thank you so much for walking us through this, no guys. Problem. Thank you so much for watching our program. Stay tuned. We're bringing you more from SHOT 2023 and SIG Range Day.